so right off the bat. Uh-huh. なんとまあ。シェイラちゃんは諦めませんよ。そして必ずステコを倒します。次の争奪戦はステコを指名しますから。ウォファ。ああ、いつでも来いよ。予想通りあいつが最後の敵か。if I can suggest something as your boyfriend. Masaka, Ultra Rock? Yes, leave it off the table. Karis Sama de Mosasaganina. Dosser, Cocoa Iken no so it the atza. Shiboraku, Tanlema bets bets nisuka. Ichi, Corredo, my two can but scare no yadashi. That might be a good idea. We disagree over this, but I still love you, Stacy. If I want to stop her from using Ultra Rock, I'll have to defeat her myself directly. If I use my weapons well enough. I swiftly began to put together a plan. And I put in a call to my sister. Several days later. Yes, and thank you. Yeah, um, it's really moving. I explained Stacy's ultra rock to her. Nisa, I mean Nesan, could you do it? Makes sense. She always. Her playful tone belayed the incredible speed of her attack. Time to psych myself up. Oh, wow, that was death incarnate. After half an hour of that, I felt like I used. Um, I felt like a used rag. <laughs> Thank you for training with me. I'm still working on that. Much to my embarrassment, the best idea I've got is to bind her up with my thread. To capture a beast, use a trap. After my sister went home. Okay, I got most of the plan done. I need to smoothly perform a series of specific actions all within the span of a second. Any longer and I could be certain she'd escape my trap. There's nothing to do but practice, practice, and practice some more. But this feels so basic. Cover her. And let it flow. I keep at it, practicing the co that combination again and again, all to defeat Ultra Rock. This just might work. Here I am, compelled to use force in order to make the heroine see the light. The other heroine. And so the day came to an end. I needed to keep at it. Lisan, thanks as always. Lisan's massage my tired bones. Ah, Lisan, you really are good at this. Lisan, about Ultrawak. I think I figured out a way to convince Stacy to seal it away. I'm going to do my best. All that's left is the question of I mean is the question of when Sheila and Stacy are going to fight.
So the fight will be the climax of the ranking battles. Zozuma-san found her. We should have assumed as much just from that. I'll have to convince Stacy by then. Some way or another, that ultra rock is too dangerous. I will. That night. Secret training isn't a walk in the park. My, is a man on your mind? Alright. Oh shit. Our lips touch. Why did my muscles just pop so? Huh? Stacy smoothly shrugged off her Good. I've got the timing down perfect. I was busy going back over the moves I'd prepared to use against Stacy. Your seal of approval is a huge confidence booster. I'm a man, I can handle this much. Why do I feel like this is going to be really painful? And there's no way to skip the hurt part and go straight to the magic. I drifted off into unconsciousness. Whoa, was I just out cold? My sister was already gone, which means time to get ready. Preparations were complete. All that remained was to bring the target to the destined location. Yeah, let's get back together. Today I'm going to take you to where I've been practicing. <laughs> Eleventh. Nah, I'm going to go against you, Stacy Connor. Ranked eleventh. This won't be a rank challenge. It'll be an unsanctioned match out here in the mountains. No, I want a battle. A battle against Ultra Rock, no less. The woman you call a hero. I'll repeat myself as often as I have to. It's too dangerous to use Ultra Rock against Shayla. I've come up with countermeasures of my own. I have a strategy to defeat Ultra Rock. If you can defeat me even so, then there shouldn't be a problem with you also using it against Shayla. That's what I want. A car entered the mountains. Yep. Again, that's fine. I'll win completely and utterly, and then you'll see that Ultra Rock is an invincible. A fact of which I'm well aware. 
気に入った男と喧嘩ってのもロックだぜ待ってなあいつを呼ぶから The first weakness that it takes time to summon チェイラ戦では呼んでから行くつもりだったよほら来るぜせいぜいあっさりやられんなよウルトラロックをより怒らせることになるからよ<笑> Here she comes <笑> Her body jerked Uh are you Miss Ultra Rock? Well, that is. I never said that last bit, but the rest, yes. You can't be willing to do that sort of thing yourself if you're not gonna, if you're not prepared to have them done to you. As Ultra Rock, her senses were impossibly honed. This too is born of my love, my love for you, Stacy. Actually, she looks like a damn demon. Her attack was in a, I mean, ineffably simple. You're fast, but compared to Nason, you're nothing. I dodged her fist and, sco uh, and scooted in close to wind my thread around her. She flexed her muscles and the thread snapped. I wasn't skilled enough to bind her that quickly, and it would probably take another five years to get to that point. Hey, I can dodge this too. Thank you, Nissan. Again and again, she sent deadly kicks at me, but I evaded them all. Uh, I bound her with conductive thread. But a little bit of electricity wasn't enough to stop her. I need more current than that. To do that, I needed to make her steal. But I can bind her. She'd break out any. She'd break out. Wait, she'd break out anything I tried. Now, I feel the trap lying under Stacy's feet. The pitfall opened up beneath her, but she skipped out of the way, just like I planned. I, then I activated the trap I laid at the point she evaded too. Uh, yeah. But the cougar. A quick leap, she knocked herself away from the second trap too. Even that wasn't enough to catch her. She's going above and beyond I, what I predicted. It, more tornado-like punches came at me. I dodged through sheer willpower. I was dodging by using everything I had, but everything I had wouldn't last long. My stamina would run dry before, I mean, long before her. I have to defeat you quickly while I can still move at full power. Stacy rushed towards me, all but creeping across the ground. Then she pounced, her teeth snapping straight towards my windpipe. Cuh, you'll even do that? 
You really are a beast. It was hard to strike someone below me and harder still to evade her rising strikes. Sorry, but I won't be playing along with that. <laughs> yeah, I borrowed a few from Azumi-san. That would keep her from rolling about and, or crawling on the ground. As she stood, I ambushed her with a kick. <laughs> She'd met my defenseless body with an anti-ear kick. Stacy dove at me. Not a chance. I fired a bullet, a thread at a branch overhead. And I followed the thread up the great tree. She rushed up after me. Perfect. I wanted you to climb this tree. Her hand had struck, uh, st uh, stuck fast to the bark. I got you with bird lime. And next, I covered her with the thread I'd hidden in the sleet in the leaves. And a heartbeat later, I let electricity fold through that special made net. I predicted that combo for countless hours, and I did it smoothly, sending the electricity coursing into her before she could realize what had happened and finish yanking herself free. She kept struggling and didn't manage to break free, but I'd already hit her with enough juice. She slid helplessly down the tree. All right, Ultra, rock down. With my thread, I I bounded Stacy tight. Target secured. If you were your normal self, you would have realized I intentionally left my stomach open when I jumped. I'd made my thread armor heavier to compensate. Yes, because I needed you to realize that you aren't invincible. The, the normal you would have noticed that obvious bait. But a counter meta strategy is exactly what you can't afford to lose too. I guarantee that whatever Shayla has in mind, it'll make what I done look like child's play. I, I admit, Ultra Rock is powerful and scary, but... Part of that results from your ability to change in the middle of battle. Once someone comes hurt hunting you with a plan, you're finished. You need to fight Shayla as your normal self. This plan only worked because I knew you'd be using Ultra Rock from the get-go. All the strength in the world is useless without a mind to direct it. So why not simply try to weave it all together as best as you can? So now that that's un water under the bridge... Why don't I have my way with my captured prey? I'm kidding. Although, since you're already tied up... As I vowed, I think I'll make you blush. Exactly! You always tell me, Stacy, to be a man of my word, so I intend to keep my word. I'm going to do something embarrassing, or should I say, something wonderful. <laughs> Let me do you, Stacy. I tremble with excitement as I strip my bound girlfriend.
And I believe that was the writer saying that. Stacy had worked up a sweat training. We all do. It's nothing. My hard work paid off. ちょっと良くないなんなんだよ、たく。数日後戦うんだぞ。なあなあなあ。でも同じ会社で働く仲間です。何考えてやがる。争奪戦を街中でやるだ。空気の中地師たちの共演。最後のステージです。できるだけ
I'm impressed you knew. Including my three sizes. But I'm a citizen. But I'm a citizen of the city too. Wow. Then it's only fair if you tell me your three sizes. It's the kind of thing I'd expect to know as I'm your boyfriend. And calling them bazangas feels too vague, so. <laughs> if my eyes are any judge, I say you're a 92, 55, 88, or so. Uh, says, I know a way to make them grow. <laughs> she gonna call the popo. <laughs> They're dating though, so I don't even think that'll work. The police be like, really, motherfucker, you called me for this shit? <laughs> sure. Hey, familiar face passed by. Good day, ma'am. The Lady of Kawakami. Uh, should I be worried about that? Folks living around here are people I've known for a long time. They'd watched over me since I was little. Yes, she's my girlfriend. I always wanted to show off my girlfriend and now I can. Yes, yes he is. Is it working? Of course it's fucking working. Maybe there is a Kuzumochi doll arc. No such luck. You should see how many there are come New Year's. Nesan, uh, thanks, thanks for all your help back then. I won thanks to you. I thought maybe I'd show Stacy some of the hidden gems of Kawakami. Uh, yeah, she freaking lives here. What kind of game? I'll take you on. Uh-oh. Stacy Simon whipped out a revolver. I had no idea where she'd hidden it. She carried a handgun with her too. I'd never seen that before. Wait, you're serious? I decided. Do it, I played the kind. I have a bad feeling about this, so I'm saving it now. Well, common sense said it had to be a fake. I'll take the first move. I took the gun from my sister, then ready the hammer. Oh, visions of Yadan and Karin just flashed into my mind. Time to pull. This is bad for my heart. Yeah, 
時々お宝が出るって話もありますからねいい土産もできたしさあ次の観光地に行くか OK though now that I think about it by this point you'll do anything I ask regardless of whether or not I win the bet any bets She already did it. <laughs> Then we'll have to fix that and get you to 100%. The day of the match was almost upon us. Today would be the final battle. Out my ears. Shut the f Oh, hell to the no, Gakto. It too, Gakto. The hell? I mean, you ain't wrong. Lisa and Hannah Stacy are small bottles. Mm, interesting. Wait, you drank it now? Yep. That sounds about right. Stacy, you got this. それでは、ライブ前の前座を片付けてきますね。さあ、私がリクエストに応じて立ち会いしてやろう。序列11位の争奪戦を始めるぞ。みんな注目だ。おお、気づけば凄い人だかりだな。空気は派手にやるわね。
If Stacy came at Shayla with the haymaker instead. An attack the latter woman hadn't expected and to which she reacted too slowly. Her vicious back fist punch sends Shayla flying. Yep. Stacy darted in even closer. Then she walloped the other girl. A spray of poisonous phallum, I don't know if I said that right, burst from Shayla's body. But Stacy held back and smirked her teeth glistened in the sunlight. Uh, Stacy lined up Shayla in her gun sight. At that range, Stacy couldn't miss. You expected her to be dumb and then it cost you. Shayla staggered backward. Really? The hell of bullets pop bubble out the bubble until none remain. A spray of poison fire from the venom matter's fingertips. Stacy blocked the spray using her gun as a shield, then opened fire on Shayla once more. You keep trying to force her to get ultra rock. And that in this close range hand to hand combat, Stacy had the upper hand. And though Shayla fought back. Stacy soon nailed her with a mighty punch. Shayla's body tail spun through the air. Yep, a violent shudder shook Stacy's body. Aha. What? Stacy staggered to her feet. Yes, they did. Don't throw up. Of course she did. Stacy, on your right, punch through to your right. Um, Shayla threw up her hands to block the quick strike. She's in front, punch straight forward. Stop, she's using a counter. Because 
Uh, because this is her route, that's why. そう and that's sweet. And that's exactly what happened, Stacy. That's what's happening, Stacy. I, you're gonna kill her. Right. Stacy, now, 40, um, yeah, 45 degrees right. Hey, right the first time. Uh, Shayla's knife hand blue cut through wait right, knife hand blow cut through Stacy's skin. She'd been interrupted by a knee to the stomach. Stacy, she's right in front of you. わかっているのですか and Stacy bore her teeth in a menacing grin of a cougar who'd pinned her prey. Get her. She struck then with the full might of her soul. The blow sent Shayla flying. She tumbled, somersaulted in front of the crowd. <laughs> Nicely done. まさに泥仕合。でもかっこよかったわ。ああ。ステイシーさんか。ファンになりそうだ。シェイラ。お前の毒は強すぎたな。それで今まで楽に勝ちすぎた。トゥルリー。だからここ一番で本体の勝負
She lost. The club rushed towards their idol, their faces full of worry. She, she sat up. Okay, Shella's a professional. Shayla smiled, waved her hand. Then, at an angle where no, I mean, none could see her face, she slumped unconscious to the floor. Yep. Her loyal fan club watched as staff loaded her into the cookie vehicle. It's over. What sort of leader do you think she'll be? Lisan and I looked up at the blue sky overhead. One month later. この命令書4番と5番が不明瞭です。やり直し。うん。そ、そこら辺はフォローしといてくれよ。他で十分フォローしているんですよ、ステイシー。いろいろ任せてもらえるのはやりがいありますが、だからといって頼られすぎも違います
Yep. A rocket from a rocket launcher soared more inches. Wait, mere inches over her red head. <laughs> Why are you in such a rush? Ah, shit. Well, thanks for getting us both in trouble. Ah, ha, ha, ha. I can't blame you. No, Lisan, I put your priorities first. Alright, then I'm sorry, Lisan. No way I'm waiting. Now, when you say that. Not when you say that. Run. Uh-oh. Can we just leave? You've only yourself to blame, Stacy. Someday I worry you'll push her over the edge. She grabbed my hand and dragged me off with her. Though we'd become adults, life remained as exciting as ever. <laughs> 